I don't even know where to begin. No one anticipates being unhoused. It was a surprise to me to know that I had lost my housing, but it started with housing. They placed me in a hotel and I was there for a few months. And then while there, Alpha House had an opening. And so they picked me up and I was able to come here. I like to think of ourselves as supporting people who are experiencing homelessness and helping them to have whatever resources they need to, to build a better future. And this comes in many different forms beyond just housing. At one time, we have room for six families, and we try and make sure as soon as they arrive here, we're working on helping them to find uh, permanent housing out in the community. Lack of housing is only one manifestation of a much huger problem. You know, the fact that people aren't urge earning a decent living wage, the fact that healthcare is not available to everyone, um, systemic racism is a real thing. Um, there's so many factors that go into someone ending up homeless. Anybody can experience an event that just knocks them on their butt and they can't recover from it. Bad luck, right? It sometimes it's just it just comes down to that, like, oh, the situation went south. Now I'm here. I can't afford this house anymore. My story was my family deteriorated and I had nowhere to go. So being here has provided the opportunity to not worry about where are my kids gonna go, where are we gonna sleep. How are we going to eat? Um, they've provided resources as far as school clothes and transportation to school sh should they need it. Oh my God, so many resources, as far, educational resources and continuing learning. They do a lot. So I'll say that everything has gotten better and I've only been here about two or three months. There's no shame behind it. It's just I'm here because it was a choice for me knowing that this was the best place for me to be. Everybody here that I've met, we all have very different stories. I was homeless in high school, right? My family went through it for about a year and a half, and it was a tough time, right? Especially as I was in ninth grade, right? Going from the eighth into the ninth grade, that was a rough transition by itself, but then you throw being homeless on top of that, yeah, that's like... And people don't get it because people don't try to get it. But if we tried to get in, we tried to get to that place of understanding, a lot of things would change for the better. I am the volunteer and operations coordinator. I am here Tuesday through Saturday from 3 p.m. to 11 p.m. Uh, you can come in at any time during that window and fill out a volunteer application, as well as the background form if you're 18 or older. Okay. Reach out to us anytime if you have any questions, if you'd like to volunteer, because um, our doors are open, because we, we, we think of ourselves as a community center. So you're always welcome to come here. The number one thing I'm looking for is compassion. Being able to put yourself in another person's shoes and be understanding and empathetic of their situation. That's what we're looking for here. Just be kind, right? Be understanding and have love.